ನಮಸ್ತೆ ಪಾರ್ಥಾಯ ಪ್ರತಿಬೋಧಿತಾಂ ಭಗವತ ನಾರಾಯಣೇನ ಸ್ವಯಂ ವ್ಯಾಸೇನ ಗ್ರಥಿತಾಂ ಪುರಾಣ ಮುನಿನ ಮಧ್ಯೆ ಮಹಾಭಾರತ ಅದ್ವೈತಾಮೃತವರ್ಷಿಣೀಂ ಭಗವತೀಂ ಅಷ್ಟಾದಶಾಧ್ಯಾಯಿನಿ ಅಂಬತ್ವಾಮನುಸಂದಿ ಭಗವದ್ಗೀತೆ ಭಗವತ್ವೇಶ ನಮಸ್ತೆ ಜೈ ಶ್ರೀ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಬಿನ್ ಕಾಂಟಂಪ್ಲೀಟಿಂಗ್ ಆನ್ ದ ಬ್ಯೂಟಿಫುಲ್ ವರ್ಸಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಶ್ರೀಮದ್ ಭಗವದ್ಗೀತ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ನೌ ರೀಚ್ ದ ಸೆವೆಂಟೀನ್ತ್ ಚಾಪ್ಟರ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ವಿ ಸಾ ಹೌ ಶ್ರೀ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಪರಮಾತ್ಮ ಬಿಗ್ಯಾನ್ ಟು ಟೆಲ್ ಅಸ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ದ ಥ್ರೀ ಟೈಪ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಶ್ರದ್ಧಾಸ್ ದ ಸಾತ್ವಿಕ ರಾಜಸಿ ತಾಮದೇ ಶ್ರದ್ಧಾಸ್ ವಿಚ್ ಡಿಕ್ಟೇಟ್ ಅವರ್ ಎವ್ರಿ ಪ್ರಯಾರಿಟಿ ಟೇಸ್ಟ್ ಅವರ್ ಲೈಫ್ ಸ್ಟೈಲ್ ಅವರ್ ಯಜ್ಞ ದಾನ ತಪಸ್ ಎವ್ರಿ ಥಿಂಗ್ ನಾವು ಹೇ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪ್ಲೇನ್ಸ್ ಹೌ ಈವನ್ ದ ಹೌ ಹೌ ವಿ ಚೂಸ್ ಅವರ್ ಫುಡ್ ಹೌ ದ ಸಾತ್ವಿಕ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಚೂಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಫುಡ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಹೌ ದ ರಾಜಸಿಕ ಅಂಡ್ ದ ಥಾಮಸಿಕ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಚೂಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಫುಡ್ ಹಿಟಲ್ಸ್ ದಾಸ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಏಟ್ ಏಯ್ತ್ ಶ್ಲೋಕ ಆಯುಸತ್ವ ಬಲಾರೋಗ್ಯ ಸುಖ ಪ್ರೀತಿ ವಿವರ್ಧನಾ ಸ್ನಿಗ್ಧ ಸ್ಥಿರ ಹೃದಯ ಆಹಾರ ಸಾತ್ವಿಕ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಸಾತ್ವಿಕ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಆರ ಆಹಾರ ಕೆ ವಾಟ್ ಆರ್ ದ ಟೈಪ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಫುಡ್ ದಟ್ ಆರ್ ಲವೆಡ್ ಆರ್ ಚೋಸನ್ ಬೈ ದ ಸಾತ್ವಿಕ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಆಯುಸತ್ವ ಬಲಾರೋಗ್ಯ ಸುಖ ಪ್ರೀತಿ ವಿವರ್ಧನ ದೋಸ್ ಟೈಪ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಫುಡ್ ವಿಚ್ ಪ್ರಮೋಟ್ ಲಾಂಗಿವಿಟಿ ಆಯು ಆಯುಸ್ ಲಾಂಗಿವಿಟಿ ಸತ್ವ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ energy stamina bala of course that is also energy and stamina sattva can also be understood as it 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 creates harmony the food that we take should not be very trouble some maybe some things we like our tongue religious something but that may not be good for our tummy so that which is good for the whole body keeps everything in uh, equilibrium that is sattva bala that is stamina arogyam which promotes our health sukha it is also pleasant to the tongue pleasant to the stomach it's pleasing it is very gentle and preeti vivardana uh, we fall in love with that food that like we uh, it, it is lovable like we don't get disgusted with that food because it is very pleasant rasya it is juicy it is full of juice uh, and snigdhah it is soft smooth not hard to eat sthirah something which is quite stable firm or substantial hridya something which is good really nice and lovable pleasant tadrsha that kind those kinds of ahara sattvika sattvika priya these are what the sattvika people like here we should understand that when shri krishna tells about the sattvika rajasika tamasika ahara he is not mentioning any particular vegetable or fruit or any particular pulse or grain etc he is giving a very generic description because krishna is a jagat guru if somebody is not a jagat guru but confined to one's mata or mata or panta who has this very narrow understanding they will start mentioning a vegetable or a grain and say only this is sattvika and this is tamasika and hurl uh, abuses other at other people who use another kind of, kind of way, grain or vegetable and they appease their ego but krishna is not like that he is a very mature guru he knows that in different parts of the world different types of grains are available different types of vegetables are available so the geography of a place the climate of a place the availability of vegetation in a place all these are important they all have a very important role uh, they are all factors which define the nature of our food so he gives a very generic description as to what is a sattvika ahara so he doesn't say this is sattvika and this is not sattvika he tells that which is juicy that which is soft and good for the tummy which is harmonious which doesn't create any disturbance in the body which promotes longevity which promotes sattva and stamina and health which uh, makes us happy which is pleasing which is gentle such things are sattvika he says so whatever kind of food which fits this description of krishna is sattvika for us we have we should never try to hurt or fling abuses on somebody else's food style if it is a very harmful yes as human beings we have every right to point out and say that is wrong with due respect we can tell them this is wrong this is not good for your health i think you should stop and change your way but to um, to just appease our ego saying i eat only sattvic food and you eat all tamasic food is wrong so whatever is the availability in particular places and whatever is 
truly good for them in those particular regions is fine for them but krishna gives a very generic description where anybody in any part of the world can design their um, ahara krama their food uh, patterns according to the dictates of shri krishna so this is the mark of a jagat guru who can who keeps everybody in mind he has loka karuna he has everybody on the mind and not just one cult or one uh, particular uh, school of thought in mind but he tells this for the guru of the whole world what krishna says next as the uh, rajasa taste of food rajasa style of food in the next shloka we'll see in the next episode namaste jai shri krishna TV Vikrama National Bharat Bhagya Vidata Subscribe TV Vikrama National and don't forget to click bell icon button and select all notification